decade separates these two fighters when it comes to the age with similar height and some differences in reach. All right, now for the official introductions, we go to the veteran voice of the Octagon, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Mario Yamasaki. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City, it's time! Five rounds in the UFC middleweight division. Introducing us, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a Muay Thai kickboxer and jiu-jitsu fighter, holding a professional record of 34 wins, 8 losses, and 1 no contest. He stands 62 inches tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Fighting out of Cura Team of Brazil, ladies and gentlemen, presenting the former UFC middleweight champion of the world, Anderson, the Spider Silva. And now to defeat the opponent, fighting at the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, only professional record now. 15 wins, no losses. He stands 64 inches tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Israel, the last day of Denver, Adesanya! All right, I gave instructions to you guys in the locker room. I want you guys to follow my orders at all times. Defend yourself at all times. Touch gloves. This is a fight that we have been looking forward to for a long time and is about to take place right now. I'm very excited. Here we go, first round. You ready? You ready? Well, first it's a building that has hosted so many classic fights. We are underway at Madison Square Garden, right here in the heart of New York City. So here we go at the start of round one. Anderson Silva didn't even go to a decision from 2004 to 2009. He has been a fast starter. Most of his UFC fights ending in round one or round two. We'll see how he approaches the early going here. on three minutes to go. Look at this. Back to his feet. Oh, that is as good a jab as you will see. Both men landing in that exchange. Clean inside leg kick. Pretty good kicks there by Silva. Anderson Silva with another vicious leg kick. Oh, absolutely. You've seen the leg buckle at times. Those leg kicks will really slow you down. Inside leg kick is there. Oh! Front kick to the face! He's got him hurt here. He hurt him! Silva gets hit with a kick. Oh, he 
missed that kick. Finds a home for that left hook. Big hook to the body. Whoa, head kick. Whoa! He's down! Elbowing him in the face. And he landed the right hand there. Full guard. Guillotine! Guillotine! The tight guillotine. That is a tight guillotine. And this might just be a oh matter of time. Oh, my God! And that will do it! He got the choke for the tap. Well, yeah, Joe, he told us during fight week he's been working dutifully on his submission game and he was going to look for an opening here tonight. Safe to say he found one near-perfect setup on the choke. It was sunk in deep, and his opponent had no choice but to tap out or go to sleep. Let's see it again here. Deep guillotine choke, full guard for the tap. And here we see it again. Beautiful submission victory. So a seminal moment for him here tonight, Joe Rogan, as he gets the win by way of submission. Certainly one of the bigger wins of his career and as big a statement as he could have made here tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Mario Yamasaki's called to stop to this contest at three minutes, 54 seconds of the very first round. He's going to win it by tap out. We do a guillotine choke. Anderson, the spider! Silva! Well, his smile lights up the room, and his performance lit up this arena tonight. Congratulations to the wildly popular Anderson Silva. No matter where we go in the world, Silva about as beloved and respected.